Five Coloradans were killed when a man opened fire in Denver and Lakewood in December. A Lakewood police officer also was hurt. One of those victims was Alicia Cardenas. She owned a tattoo parlor in Denver. Cardenas is now being honored in a special exhibit in Denver. Denver 7's Christian Lopez reports on how her friends are using this exhibit to keep alive her legacy. The Corn Mothers exhibit began about 20 years ago. Corn Mothers, women from all walks of life who selflessly serve their communities. All of these women that have really made up who the Southwest is, our stories. It's those stories exhibit curator Renee Fajardo celebrates at the History Colorado Center. Because we don't hear a lot of their stories. The exhibit is also a chance to preserve their legacy. Since the induction of these 70 women, eight of them have passed. All of the 70 women you see here were chosen by people from their communities to be honored as a corn mother. This year at the exhibit, you will notice that one of the portraits looks a little different and carries a lot of significance. Alicia had really wanted to be part of this project. She was always like, oh, I want to be a corn mother. Alicia Cardenas, who was gunned down in a mass shooting in December. She had been selected as a 2022 corn mother before her death. When she was murdered, it was a great blow to us to the whole community and to honor her we wanted to make sure that she was still part of this project we didn't take her picture before she died that's where artist Emmanuel Martinez comes in I think they felt that it would be more significant to do a painting Martinez was Alicia's mentor and close friend for years this bowl is like you got this spiritual energy like coming out and uh, reflecting off of her and, it, and it's incorporated into her tattoos. And I it, it was honored to be asked and, uh, and I felt I would do something that uh, reflected uh, the, the kind of spirit that she, she had. That spirit now living on through this exhibit and those who knew her best. She just touched everybody that, uh, that knew her. Reporting in Denver. She gave a lot, a lot of herself to our community. I'm Christian Lopez, Denver 7.